Ah, hello, how are you? And uh, I have good friends with me from Clonduff, and you're with Destination Yuri. The morning program, good morning, Yuri, and morn in the world. You are extraordinarily welcome, as indeed is Patricia McGivern. How are you this morning? Good morning. And Seamus Murray, and uh, Mickey Tumulty, yeah, Mickey morning. the Bones. Yes. I think we'll start right away with hearing the Bones. Okay. Give us a go in the... Where do you hear this, guys? This is wonderful. Away you go. Come on, guys. Well done, bravo, bravo, bravissimo, very well done, that's, that's me. These good folk are from the Clonduff Community Association and this Thursday is Clonduff Community Association's Positive Aging Day. That's Patricia, right. what's that all about? Well, I, we used to run a luncheon club in Kirkcullion House where Community Association is situated. And we used to have it three days, then it went down to two days, then it went down to one day, and then it has sort of fizzled out and the hotel sort of runs a luncheon club now of a Wednesday. Mm. So this is a sort of an active aging day, not a luncheon club as such. It's people that are, say, over 50 that they can take on active things. Yeah, like what? What's the sort um, of things you're thinking about? Well, the sort of things we're thinking about is knitting and crocheting, yeah, for doing the women. up wee bits of or furniture the for the men. <laughs> we're well, they doing a wee, bit, wee bit of history. History. And one project we were thinking of was maybe the school children and the older people maybe writing a book. Yeah. And the older people tell them what it was like when they were at school. Yeah. And the younger people tell them what they're what it's like now when they're at school and maybe down the years they could read this book and yeah you know well sort it's of capturing like it'll be capturing a bit of history that would otherwise disappear uh -huh, uh -huh. you know and that's important you know uh -huh. so where did the idea come from for the, the the active aging day well the active aging day come about there was a few people that had went to the luncheon club and they had mentioned to me about um you know maybe having things to do that they're go to their luncheon club one day a week and then the rest of the week they're sitting in the house aye, doing aye. nothing. Yes. So it's a sort of so friendship yeah. thing. So things can grow out of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Great. That was, it's a friendship thing. Are there, would there be much loneliness out around Clonduff? Would there, there be is. people living alone and, you know? There is because uh, Clonduff takes in Cabra as well as Helltown. Yeah. And there, you know, it's a country area too, and there's people isolated. I, are there really? There are really people isolated. So, yeah. you know, maybe if we, people that has no family, you know. And that's part. You know, yeah, there yeah. was a time in all our lives, that's boys right, and girls, right. mm -hmm. when we would never have count, countenanced that su such a thing would be possible. Well, that people yeah. would be there without family. But yeah. the, the older we get, the more of that we see. That's well, right. mm -hmm. you know, we run a day trip to when it just happened to be we did do day trips and we'd done holidays when we did run the luncheon club and there was one wee woman we had in Dublin one day with us and she was 82. God love her. And she turned around and she says this is the first time I've ever been in Dublin. Goodness gracious. Mm -hmm. And that's, that's five wonderful. years ago. Would you Isn't believe that, that that? Yeah, that is, that's a huge that thing. And you like see at all, our, at all our ages, once you get a certain age, you, you don't have to worry about paying any fares to go to Dublin. Mm -hmm. right. You get free, that's which right. is the big thing. That's right. So this is all... So, but, I mean, Clondoff is now doing what the world tries to do, positive mm -hmm. ageing, yeah. active ageing. Yeah. Right. But, I mean, you've taken it by the scruff of the neck and making it happen. You know, Seamus, you're, you're involved, Seamus Murray. Uh, yeah. What did you... Are you still working or are you retired? No, retired. What did you do, Seamus? <clears throat> Just general labour. Yeah, and where would you labour? Would you have been in England at all? Well, uh, I was working from abroad. No, I was never in England. No. Yeah, I worked from abroad. Which is maybe he a good thing. For Newry and Morn. Yeah. Doing yeah. Wee of play parks and things. Okay, you enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. You're yeah. right in the open air, and you have your own boss. Which yeah. Is, which was More a grand enough thing. So, what do you think for you will come out of this active aging pro program? 
Well, hopefully this will learn wee skills and that there might be a wee bit of woodwork and things yeah. like that and making things. Yeah. A sort of a... Well, the woodwork and the ma making things, you could introduce that yourself and then get somebody along to, to help. Yeah, you know, yeah. if you show enthusiasm, all these yeah. things can happen, you know. Tom Duff, that's... that's uh, that's Muslim territory. That's Muslim territory. You could kick a football out there. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the day he picked up the Sam Maguire for the first time, Kevin. Mm -hmm. Kevin Muslim. Oh, right, yeah. He was the schoolmaster there at the time, that yeah, lovely yeah, wee school. He was my schoolmaster that time. Was he? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Overlooking the mm -hmm. football field as it is today, the day, yeah. that week, that place at the, at the corner. Absolutely. And Michael, positive aging. Yes. You'll never grow old because you play music. <laughs> You know, I, hope, I hope not. <laughs> okay, I wish you have a long way to go. The music started for you when? The bo do you play anything other than the bones? Uh, Boram. You play the Boram? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, the bones now, where did, how did you get involved in the bones? Well, the oh, are, these, are these human bones? The cow bones. Cow bones, ah. yeah. Now, if you were in Papua New Guinea or somewhere like that, That's you right. could have human bones That's because right, there's ah. a bit of cannibalism hey, going on there. So these are cow bones. Cow bones, hi. It took me a wee while to learn to play them now. Right. They're not, they're not, the, they're not that easy played, you know. Yeah. But I, I think the music has to be in you. Yeah. You know, to play them. I would say it's 30 years ago from I started playing them. And how? what were the circumstances of you starting? What happened? Well... My good friend Frank Rooney, as we're standing about him, he was in this uh, uh, pub this night uh, out the road outside of Friend. And there was some boy, an old boy, giving me a set of these here. Yep. And I think he never was fit to play, play aye, them, you know. Aye, aye. But I got on fine with him, you know. So and you, you, you started then. Well, you would have first of all have to take all. Did you eat the meat off them first of all? <laughs> so, <laughs> no, but I mean, say, uh, you yeah, you have to do that. Yeah, you put you. But they would have the bacon. You wouldn't get the bones too much on the. No. You know, you need to get no. The bacon ribs mm -hmm. would be all right for. That's it. right. Uh, but would would bacon would the pig give a different kind of sound to the cow? Uh, no, not no, really. No, just not be really. more or less not the really. same. But it's mostly the cows that come out of. Aye. You know? How do you hold them? Let me see the way you hold them there. Goodness gracious, what do you do? See this one here now. This one, that one never moves. Let me see that one. That never moves. This now. one is like that. Uh, that, one st that one stays tight. That stays tight. And this, this one here? This one goes in here. In here. Uh, but, uh, but it takes a lot of practice to keep dropping that here, Alan. Andrew, look, I'm out of the shot. Andrew. 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 My dear boy, I'm out of the shot. Could something be done about it? You know, please form the shot. Thank you very much indeed. Goodness gracious. That's me. Mm. They're lovely. They're lovely, lovely thing, you know. I have more than one set. That's your name on them as well. <coughs> and you got it in 1989. 19, that was the year he got them. Yeah, the, yeah. But the uh, oh, Bones is home. He brought me a good set out of America. Yeah. They're you know. America. Oh, San Francisco is in. And but would they have been made professionally, or would they have been well, simply? Well, I don't know. He said they were got out of some animal out of the, ah, de out of the desert. Out of the desert. Uh, they are bigger than those now. So they would be maybe that size, maybe heavier. But I'd rather have the uh, the small ones. Yeah. You know? But there you, you do it properly for me now. Let's hear it once again. This is the bone. We're now going to hear the bones being properly played. Right. Right. La, 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 la. We can all sing to it, can we? Let's yeah. have a go. One, two, three. Sing, I da, la, 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 Dum da dee da 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 diddly da 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 diddly da 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 a drink or two might be oh, go very some, well with it. See some big days at them. I say go, you have done. Used to go to all the flowers, you know. Yeah. The way down south. Yeah. Used to be great crack with them. Yeah. And you went, went all over the place. All over the place. Yeah. yeah. 
Might there be music at this uh, active aging day? Well, there is. There's um, at eleven o'clock. There is a film show. Trace your own roots. Really, that's that's the beginning of it, isn't it? That's the beginning. Mm. So eleven o'clock it begins. Yeah. Trace your own roots. And who's putting that on, or what is that about? Well, it's um, round the district in the fifties and sixties. A film show. Yes. And uh, the senior citizens consortium are. Okay. Denise McBride is bringing that. And is it dealing with? Is it dealing with your area, the way yeah, things used yes, to be? Yes. Yes. How were things in the old days, or fifty years ago, sixty years ago, out there? What What stories do you hear of it? Um, Mickey, that'd be over to you, would it? You bet that, that, the old days. The, the old ways well, in the old know, days, Mickey. I, I wouldn't be long enough, maybe I'll turn to know that. Seamus, would well, you, you remember, know Do you remember market days and the like of that? Oh, hi, the sheep oh, fairs and all the streets, yeah. like. Oh. Mm. They're not long quit. No. 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 Yeah. Did you lose? Did did, did Hilltown lose all the sheep at the time of the foot and mouth thing? I suppose you did. No. 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 no, no. no. Well, it didn't no. affect us. Did well, not you, you, really. You were no. Okay. We were okay. But then there's the bully fair as well. You're yeah. involved mm -hmm. in that. The bully fair. Mickey builds the bully hut. Uh, do you? The bully hut. And the bully hut is for the shepherd to live in mm. when he's out looking after the sheep. Is mm -hmm. that right? That's yeah. right. All right. Yeah. There was a big story behind that. Well, what is the story about uh, that? Uh, uh, See, the, 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 the Emory Hut was built in the mountains oh, maybe two or three hundred years ago. And they, when it comes to a certain time of year, the farmers would have went to, and stayed in the huts. Yeah. Maybe they took the whole family with them. Yeah. And they stayed there as long as the, uh, the wire was good and, and looked after uh, the sheep. And How long would they have been out in the hill? Uh, well, in good weather, say? Well, maybe... I would say maybe couple of months. They would have gone for two months? Oh, maybe a couple of months. Really? Yeah. Uh -huh. And the, uh, that's the story behind the Billy Hut. Yeah. And you built the, you, yeah, what yeah. do you build the hut out of? Um, well, it, it was built in them days with turf. Yeah. But we just built it, with, you know, just ordinary swords. Aye, aye. Was, I don't know if you saw the programme. You didn't see him on TV up at the mountain with a Joe... Uh, but Joe Mahon. Joe Mahon. Wow. And lesser spotted Ulster. Did you see that? I missed that. Did and you I'm sorry that? I missed it. Because uh -huh. Joe, Joe would be a good friend of mine. I'd go uh -huh. back a long well, way with him. Joe, uh, we worked in the BBC together. Yes, uh -huh. Mickey was I mean, on that programme ah, yes. building his yeah. hut. Yeah. yeah, great stuff. Great stuff. <laughs> so was. You could, a man could live in a bully for a hut. Huh? A man could live in a bully hut. Or oh, there was money to one lived in it uh, during the time. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> all night. All night. <laughs> all night. <laughs> all night. <laughs> Depend, <laughs> depending <laughs> on the state of uh, uh, maybe a bottle of stuff. And whether, <laughs> whether he'd be allowed back home again or <laughs> they right, sobered that's up. Right, that's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. It was a work of charity that you did. That's right. That's to right. look after them, uh, you know. Look after you know. Them. I like doing it. Of course you I'm do. nearly getting past it. <laughs> oh, far. What are you talking about <laughs> nearly getting past it? What age are you now? Um, 78. You are not. Oh. But he's doing something right. It is. Look at the clearness mm -hmm. of eyes. He's got a clear eye in his head, and it's all it's all good. Oh, he's a great man for the history too. Yeah, yeah. So Thursday's the day. So you have the film show to begin with. Then what's happening? Then we're having lunch at twelve o'clock. Yes, where'll that be? All in Hilltown Hall. Hilltown Hall. Yes. Who's doing the cooking? Um, we're getting our lunch from the Diamonds. Wow, lovely. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Good. And then at uh, one o'clock we have Larry McGuigan coming in, and for the ones less able, we have gentle chair exercises. Oh yeah, who's Larry McGuigan? Um, He's coming in to help. A ballroom dancer. Oh, a ballroom ball dancer. Huh. Him and his wife huh. Anne. Do you know what I'm thinking here? You were telling me there's a whole lot of lonely people in in out there in Clondoff. Uh -huh. So if you've got lonely people, I'm thinking here, listen, in Varna. So if you've got a lonely woman and a lonely man and a ballroom dancer <laughs> teaching you and the band, listen, don't We did it. have romances in our old dungeon club. You're joking, did oh, you? Oh, we did. Romances? Romance, and yeah. The, you know something, and they often say love is better uh -huh. the second time around. Uh -huh. <laughs> Are you spoken for yourself, sir? Pardon? Are you spoken for yourself? Have yeah. you a lady yourself? Yeah. Oh, I have. Ah, yes. Ah, that's good. I'm and yourself, I'm Seamus, what about you? No, my no. wife's dead. Ah, bless her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, you have a friend in heaven, yeah. which is grand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not all of us can say that, I no. tell you. Mm -hmm. But the, the, the whole issue of loneliness is important. I slightly joke about it, but 
if you're doing something there to bring people together and give them a reason I know, yeah. uh, for going from day to day, you're doing a great thing. You know. Well, you see, um, in Hilltown there, the Hilltown Community Association conducted a survey and they went out, give a survey to every house in Cabra and Hilltown. Yeah. And this is one of the findings that a lot of the people were lonely and wanted something for the elderly. Yes. So this this is why this so is really coming about. This is people power. Yeah, yeah. It's not been handed down to you by somebody up in the top. Mm -hmm. This is you guys saying, look, this is what we want. Mm -hmm, and that, mm -hmm. That's the way it, that's mm -hmm. the way it's shaking down. Mm -hmm. Well, Thursday's the day. Mm -hmm. uh, we wish you luck. Thank you. Thank you. you were frightened about doing this, were you? We were a bit nervous. We were a bit nervous. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Do we get a wee practice first? They said. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Now I said, "No, we'll be going live." She near dropped. <laughs> it wasn't. It was okay. Okay. You enjoyed on. it. Mm -hmm. okay. We had music. We had the crack. We had singing. We had the laughter. <laughs> yeah. And we had the, yeah. the history of of Clondalk. Mm -hmm. So let people. Do you want to see? It'll not just be. What about visitors? Will you take visitors? Oh, out we to have. See you? We have ones coming from Warren Point, Addy Call, Newry. Really. Um, Good. And along Newcastle, there's a few couple coming from. are going to have a great time. So we are really. It's oh, going to yeah. be a big day, and if well, anyone, a, I get the feel of it. Uh -huh. I think it is going to be good. But if anybody wants to come along, they're yeah. more than welcome. Everybody Anybody is welcome. welcome. Yeah, you're okay. welcome yourself now. Well, now if I can be there, I will be there. But uh -huh, be, uh -huh. they never let me. The, uh, uh, you haven't yeah. seen the chain that ties me to the chair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Will you play us out on the bones, and then we'll that, well, that'll be us saying goodbye to you. Oh, yes. We'll all give it. Give us a. Uh, another rattle and we'll try and sing with you right now. We'll follow you. Give us a challenge there now. my thanks to Patricia, to Michael and to Seamus. Thank you for coming in. We'll see you Thursday, well, 11 o'clock in the much. morning out there at yes. the hall. And then we'll have a great day indeed. Take care. Go well. God bless you. Yeah. Thank All you. Thank you. Thank you.